called Year of the Horse. <laughs> Journal. I was thinking for a long time today, maybe too long, I was thinking like a ninja. I was compartmentalizing. Ninjas do that. They compartmentalize while hanging upside down dressed in black. And I was thinking about horses. I was thinking about horses, about how everybody, and I mean every single body, every single body, even if that body is next to another body or with a group of bodies, I'm signaling out each body. Even if they are a couple, couples try to come off as one body, as an everybody, meaning the two of them. I hate that. I only see them as each a single body. I don't care what they want or how they feel, these bodies. Everybody thinks of horses as being these beautiful creatures. A horse's eyes are so full of emotion, they're so expressive. Horses do this thing to people, this sort of magical power thing over people, a sort of mind numbness. Horses have a kind of magical mind numbness over humans. It keeps them from seeing the horses for what they really are. This magic only lets them see these horses as these beautiful, majestic creatures, horses. Nobody wants to think about what's under the tail. Horses have beautiful long manes of hair and beautiful wispy tails and thick long wispy hair if it's possible, if it's possible to be thick and wispy at the same time. But nobody thinks about how large a horse's penis is, this large chafed mass that drops nearly to the floor. The horse's lean muscular body that lines from its chest down to its back, its hind quarters, the lines the aesthetic like a sneak machine like the fastest Italian sports car. A horse will crap anywhere. It will lift its tail and poop whenever it wants to go. In fact, it's one of the things you can't train in a horse. It will crap. It will poop a small hill wherever and whenever it wants. When running, a horse is mesmerizing. When anybody sees an image of a horse or horses running, especially in slow motion, it's a showstopper. It's a universal showstopper. They all, all these bodies, they get still. Faces get all dreamy, dreamy bodies, dreamy over horses. The horse will piss buckets whenever it needs to. A never-ending stream of piss, which is fine if the horse is in a field, but if you're but if you're on a stage or if you're you're standing next to it, if, if you're riding a horse and it has to piss, it will stop and piss. And if there's other riders around it, they will all stop and watch your horse piss. And what if you don't want to be looked at by bodies on horses, stared at by bodies on horses while pissing is happening underneath you? And God forbid crapping starts. And if it does, if your horse starts to crap, and then these bodies around you, everybody, all these bodies on horseback will start making little sounds, noises, little comments about the size. Not to worry, though. There's no reason to be embarrassed, none at all. It doesn't matter you're on an animal while it's pissing and pooping this beast that's being watched by these magically possessed bodies who are numb, these bodies who only see horses as being majestic and beautiful. I hate these bodies, everybody, every single body. Again, I'm singling each and every single body. Sword. 